So, hello. So, isa po akong ECE Electronics Engineer. Diba? Dati kasi Electronics and Communications Engineer. But ngayon, Electronics Engineering tawag dyan. So, this is a video for all freshmen out there sa mga bagong salpak sa universidad. No? So, gusto mag-ECE or maging Electronics Engineer. So, these are my tips. Number one, shift. A ah, joke lang, hindi naman. Okay, I think your mind is made up. No? Clear and unequivocal kung gustong gusto mo sure na talaga ECE pag hindi well you can watch this video okay here are my tips for you freshmen out there na gustong mag-enroll or mag maging engineer in the future okay so for freshmen I would like to say number one if hindi ka magaling sa math don't worry there is hope for you okay bakit? kailangan mo lang talaga is masanay practice habang hindi pa kayo naka-enroll. Paano, anong mga subjects? So, number one, basic algebra and a bit of trigonometry. You must master these two subjects before even going to university life. Kasi ngayon, K-12 na, iba na kasi ng panahon. No? So, sabi nila, calculus na yung first basic subject. Sa amin dati, algebra, ngayon, calculus na. So, ang calculus naman is almost algebra and trigo in one. Trigonometry and algebra, di ba? Parang ibang level of concept lang. Okay. But still, you must master this. Practice lang. Kasi ako, fav- uh, hindi ko favorite ang math. I hate ko talaga yung subject na math. I don't like solving. I don't like numbers. Pero nagustuhan ko engineering because not of the numbers per se, but because of the concept. The critical thinking aspect. The creative aspect. The, the conceptual framework talaga sa isang engineer. It's not about the math. Okay? It's about the thinking, the skills, and... Also, we're just using the mathematics as a language to express certain ano, ideas. Yun lang, huwag ka matakot sa math. Madaming math, surely, but since you're a freshman, kayang-kaya nyo yan, practice lang. And also, pag freshman ka, I really don't like this subject, no? Uh, engineering drawing. Kasi, number one, pangit ng pen- penmanship ko. Hindi ako magaling magsulat. At the same time, mag-drawing, hindi ako magaling mag-drawing. Well, although nag-draw ako artistically, but hindi ko siya passion, no? Ang hirap. Kasi kailangan mo accurate sa engineering drawing. So, dito naman, practice. Okay, how do you practice? Making lines. Ruler, dapat exact yan. From 0 to 30 centimeters, exact. Gamitin nyo ang, uh, sorry, gamitin nyo ang, ano, um, at first, pencil, mechanical pencil, 0.5, 0.3. Bili kayo ng mga ganyan. T-square, kung may budget kayo, drafting table, go ahead. Ang T-square could be 24 inch or pwede 36 inch na version. It doesn't matter. Basta may T-square ka. Protractor, triangles, French curve, mga ganun. And compass. Kailangan mo man ang mga ganun equipment. Eh, kailangan mo ma-master ang mga techniques paano gamitin yan. Or paano mag-draw, di ba? Paano ka mag-draw ng mga techniques sa paano mag-draw ng mga, ano dyan, mga, sorry, mga circles, mga ellipses, ellipsoid, mga ganun. You must know that before even entering ECE. Pwede naman ma-learn nyo, but wala kayong time. You'll be adjusting pa. Okay? Next thing is not about more on the subjects, but more on yourself. Okay? Don't be too hard on yourself. Since freshman pa kayo, okay? you have a lot of things to achieve. Kaya nyo yan. Okay? Wala pa masyadong distractions in life. Mga ganun. Kaya nyo yan. So, as a freshman, you should be re- ano, ano yun, super relaxed. Relax. I mean... Don't take it too hard on yourself that, that the world is going to end pag hindi na kuha ang gusto nyo or hindi kayo na, let's say, 74 lang kayo instead of 75. Well, then, it, it's okay. I mean, we still can live. Buhi pa man ta. So, okay pa na. Okay? Except pala siguro of ano ka nang, hala, kanina yung scholar ko, anong, maliso jug ko ani, actually, makafeel ko anong pressure. Eh. Scholar, mapupo sa una. Dili scholar sa inahan. Legit scholar ko. Hindi lang halata sa naong. Pero, scholar jug ko. Okay? But, in kasi there's a pressure na ayan na. Ano. So, basta the pressure is immense kung scholar ka. Uh, just, ano, kanang relax lang. Take time to relax. Take time to reflect. And then, do it naman. Kasi, minsan, pag sobrang burden naman natin, we cannot just move. We cannot just study Parang we don't feel like studying. Nothing's going into our brains. Parang ganun. So, relax lang. Take it easy. Okay? Even though grab yung pressure, especially first year since you're just adjusting. Relax. Okay, next. Uh, ito naman. Eat healthy. Well, I doubt. <laughs> especially freshman kayo. Eat healthy, sleep well. 
ah, those are the things that I didn't do before and it took a toll on my body. So, your body will thank you later if you get the right amount of sleep and proper diet. Kasi pag freshman, bago university life, naku, ang daming bisyo dyan, no? Ang daming mga bad influence dyan. Hindi bad influence, pero distracting influence sa inyong studies. Kasi as a student, your priority is your studies. Hindi na, ano, hindi priority ang pang, ano, pang panglaag, hindi priority ang pang gimmick gimmick. You know, just study. Because that's your duty. Okay? That's your number one sole purpose pat kayo ng university. Okay? Wag hindi naman ganun. Di, para saan pa? Di ba? So, yun. Just keep your mind uh, and your body healthy. Okay? Next naman. Ito naman. May mga professors talaga, especially pag first year, they, they're telling na, uh, this term, without the weaklings. So, ang mga hindi bagay sa engineering, tanggal, shift na kayo sa ibang kurso. Because engineering is immense. I mean, the thinking skills required is so immense, the pressure is so immense, so you want to relieve that pressure by studying in advance, okay? Also, by practicing drawing techniques in advance, and at the same time, be resilient. I mean, kanang, na mga professors na lisujud kayo, kanang, whew, it's so difficult, they're so terrorizing, they're agonizing to deal with, they cannot even have compassion, they're worse than the enemies of the state, parang ganun. Oh, grabe. Pero don't worry, don't mind that. Mind yourself. Okay? Mind your learning. Have I learned something? Have I not? Have I mastered the concept? Ganun. You don't mind about the professor. Just think na walang personality yung professor. Sabi niyo, oh, basta it's myself. Ang kailangan ko is ako lang. Okay? May mga iba naman kasi sabihin na, boy, hindi ka marunong makisama. Cheating ba? Pero, oh, if you're cheating, you're just fooling yourself. In the long run, sisingiling ka niyan. Okay? Hala! Ano yan? Di ko alam yung concept na yan. The higher math, di ko alam yung matrix na yan. Ano yung matrix? So, di ba? Mag- to just haunt you back if you're just cheating, if you're giving in to peer pressure. So, parang ganun. So, as much as possible, here's the next tip. Don't cheat. Okay? Meron mga cheating sa engineering, but in the long run, they will bite you at the rear end. Nangyari yan is, oh, ngayon, nagkodigo ako, or nangopia sa classmate ko. Pero pagdating sa exam, na-remember ko kaya yung nakopia ko? Alam ko ba yung nakopia ko? Ano nga yun? Diba? Parang tayo pang, tayo pang lugi niyan, no? It's better if you do your own job. You do learning, okay? Kasi ako, as a person, uh, I hate the thing of studying, but I really love learning. Like, everything, I love learning. I don't know why I cannot escape learning because life never stops teaching. So, yun. So, ngayon, ano pa yung mga freshman tips ko sa inyo? May mga professor na, life... BI, Marcala, cheating, ano pa man. Mm. Oh, ito. If you really love electronics engineering, you really love it. You like to learn. Read magazines, electronics engineering. Just like this one. Oh. I'll get this one. This one. This is an old magazine I got. Okay. Binigay lang to sa akin. This is electronics enthusiast. Para, parang 90s, di ba? 80s pa. Ang laman nito is mga circuit boards, mga circuits, may mga schematics. Okay, madaming mga information to read about the circuits, the operation, para hindi na kayo mahirapan in the majors. Sabi nila, oh, academics, mas study-study lang. No, it's about the passion of design, the passion of learning the circuits. Yan ang engineering, electronics engineering. Okay, hindi lang sila basta math lang, hindi lang basta physics. It's more than that. It's, ano, science and art beyond conception for me. That's why I really like ECE. That's why I chose ECE because it's really close to my heart. And the uh, problem is, but ako nag ECE? If you want to know, funny, very funny. I start kasi ako before as, you know, high school, guitar, guitar person. Guitar hero guy, hindi. Guitar hero, legit guitar talaga. And wala kasi akong pera bumili ng electronics pedal. That's why I tried to assemble mine. And I discovered you need electronics. You need a lot of knowledge electronics. Not just kanang, you know, kaila-kaila lang. No, you really need to study. You really need to dig deep. Gusto ko ng distortion pedal, ito yung circuit. Gusto ko ng chorus pedal, ito yung circuit. At first, I was really blind. I don't know what I was doing. But over time, over the span of uh, four years, I kind of get got the hang of it naman. Okay? Medyo matagal ang four years, pero to think hindi ako focus sa electronics na, ano lang, parang hobby-hobby lang. Until it dawned on me na, gusto ko talaga ng design. I want to learn electronics. I want to know the magic behind electricity and the concepts behind that mga ganun gusto ko mag-design ng sarili ko so from the effects pedal turn into career so that was really kind of a jump napakalayo no as a 
as a guy na you know, high school guitar hero dude uh, pumunta na sa college mag-learn na ng ECE what a shallow motive no tingin nyo uh, I don't know what your reasons pag number one ito sinasabi nila gusto ko ECE kasi madaming pera hmm, pag sure eh. wa, murag wa man dyan wala <laughs> gamay lang pera sa ECE hindi mo ganun kadami it's about the passion it's about the drive it's not about the money if you want the money then I guess you don't like ECE at all just take another course not this one because you really need love L-O-V-E and passion just like other careers okay? this is not about the fun ano lang minsan kasi we're not so disciplined diba? sometimes ako hindi ako disciplined mag-study gusto ko lang talaga mag-surf ng net pero ginagawa ko I'm still learning I'm not learning the, the lessons, but I'm learning other things beyond the lessons. So, yun ang ginagawa ko. So, mga first year, if you want that kind of habit to learn, to be passionate, try to learn things related to your course, like ECE, the magazines, the circuits, okay, the, the concept behind them. Nila kasi lahat sa textbook makikita. Minsan kasi, there are technicians that are really knowledgeable about electronics, about repair. Try to talk to them. Try to consult to them. Kasi ang galing nila. Promise. Estudyante lang kayo. Pero sila, they're the masters of, of hand wizardry. Gusto yun naman mga uh, about communication, mga equipment na mga napakaganda, design. You talk to electronics engineers working in semiconductors. Napakagaling na nila. Mga gawa-gawa ng circuit. If you want people who are really good in speaking about about the concept, go to the academy. You ask your teachers. Okay? So that's my last tip, I guess. I think the last tip is uh, find the right people and ask them the right questions. Okay? okay, the hardest part is asking the right questions because you don't even know what to ask. You're, you don't know what to learn. You don't know anything about what to expect. So formulating the question is halfway solving the answer for it. So, yun ang aking philosophy. No? So, parang knowing the problem is halfway solving the problem itself. Parang ganun. So, hopefully, nakatulong to sa mga engineering freshmen. No? If you are... Uh, watching this video sa mga vlog ko I don't know if you're just watching or for fun or for uh, or ano yun trip lang if bored kayo oh, kasi ngayon parang wala kasi akong ano eh parang I don't kailangan ko kasi mag-study I need to read a lot of things ang legit taghan isa kalibro akong pasahon karong gabi eh. the problem is I don't want to read I just want to talk I want to vent out these uh, things that I want to help you guys yun talaga gusto ko gusto ko makatulong kasi baka in the end Uh, sasabihin nyo na hala oy okay to siya eh. nakatulong ah, that's really a good thing basta ako gusto ko makatulong that's why I have this YouTube channel uh, ang money ko dito konti lang <laughs> Oof, wala nga wala pa akong pera na claim dito ito kasi kailangan mo ng minimum requirement mga ganun subscribers and everything so I'm just helping you out about this engineering career of yours don't think about work muna okay because work will just follow okay as long as you love doing it go. Hindi naman masama mag-aral. Hindi naman masama mag engineer Hindi naman masama mag ECE. Hindi naman ako nakakasiran ibang tao. Just go. Pursue. Bahala na matagal aking, ano, kasi minsan sabi na madidelay ka, ganun-ganun. Dami yung factors para madelay. Pero number one, kalaban mo is yourself. Yourself. Kalaban mo sarili mo. So hopefully naka-inspire ako, maybe. So please, hit that subscribe button. Comment down below. Hit the like. Yun lang. So, see you around. If, and if you ma-meet, if, sorry, F. Uh, if I meet you ako, just say, Uy, nakita ko YouTube mo. So, thank you for, ano, that video. Kasi, umaga nun, okay na, lingaw na siya. That's really good. So, see you around, though. Bye.